Hello, beautiful Libra. Come on in here. This is your weekly tarot reading. I'm Tiffany. We're here on Wasted Traditions YouTube channel. Thank you so much for joining. I'm super excited to get started with your reading. I've already blessed my cards. Also, remember, I read intuitively, so please be sure to take what resonates with you and to leave the rest. Let's go. Libra, we are going to get a couple of Oracle cards and then consult the tarot for you, Libra. This is your weekly reading for the week of March 10th through March 16th. Get in here. Let's see what spirit needs you to know right now. If you are here, no matter when this was recorded, this will this message is intended to offer guidance and support because my messages and insights that I share here in my videos, they are not constrained by time, right? They are timeless. And relevant for viewers at the time you are watching Libra thank you for being here all right let's see what we have for you Libra spirit what do you need Libra to know miracles ancient wisdom Setting boundaries, threshold, protection. This is, you're the second one. I believe I had this for, I might have had this for Leo or Virgo. This, obviously, Spirit knows that a lot of folks need to set their boundaries, honor their boundaries. Let's start here with the miracles, ancient wisdom, right? There, I hope you believe in miracles, Libra, because they're absolutely they're absolutely true, and it's a miracle that you are here. This is not happenstance. This is divine connection. So, again, thank you for joining in your reading. All right, so miracles, ancient wisdom. When you allow ancient wisdom to connect with you soul to soul, spirit to spirit, there's a communication that can happen, and it can unlock a lot of joy for you, Libra. It can unlock a lot of creativity. I got alarms, more alarms. When you connect with, you allow ancient wisdom to connect with you soul to soul, spirit to spirit, you will unlock joy and you will unlock creativity. There is a communication that happens between your soul and ancient wisdom. So let's go ahead and get some tarot. To clarify this, miracles, ancient wisdom for Libra. Spirit, what do you need Libra to know? Do tell. What do you need Libra to know, Spirit? Mm hmm. Thank you, Spirit. All right. The Emperor, Libra, Nine of Cups, and Six of Cups. All right. Miracles, Ancient Wisdom. Okay, Libra. So, the Emperor. Amazing. That is simply authority. Authority. You are the authority in your life, Libra. You are the authority in your life. You create the foundation of your life. You set the tone for how you want your life to be, Libra. And it's up to you as that authority in your life to create a secure life, something that makes you feel secure in every form of fashion, making sure your foundational beliefs are stable. And if you find that those beliefs are changing, do the work, okay? Connecting with ancient wisdom allows you to come into power, allows you to become that authority in your life, that true willpower, that true authority of your life, right? 
And then we have the Nine of Cups for you. With the Nine of Cups, this is... This is contentment and this is joy. And I feel like that communication between your soul and ancient wisdom will bring you contentment, will bring you joy, expressing a life that people, the right people are excited to see you live. Okay, Libra. And then we have the six of cups, right? Harmony. Love. Someone from your past. Someone from your past. Libra. Someone from your past has tried to take your authority. Try to take your autonomy from you. That's what I'm getting, Libra. And that stops today. Let's get some clarification. I do feel like... Someone from your past has tried to have authority over you for some time now. And you have resisted and spirit is telling you keep resisting. Connect with your angels, spirit guides, and ancestors to come into a power and authority all for you. Meant only for you. No one else can have authority over you. You are a sovereign being. And Spirit is telling you to take the steps to do so, Libra, okay? There's something going on because this deck does not, yep, does not <laughs> want to be gentle with me today, kind to me today. Or maybe it's the other way around. I don't know. Libra, you got big energy right now. I'll tell you that. Uh-huh. Can I get one more spirit? Just one more. Thank you. Okay, it's you. All right. So, Libra. Seven of Wands. Three of Wands. And the Four of Cups. I was just talking about someone from your past trying to have authority over you and that stops now the seven of wands is confirming that spirit is confirming that you will stand your ground you hold the line you are the authority in your life libra stand your ground defend your position hold the line because there is an authority a power you're coming into your own power your own personal power defend yourself at all costs <clears throat> and then we have the three of wands as you're going through this process libra you are setting the table you are making plans and you are looking to implement these changes into your life you're looking to get that started immediately and that makes me excited for you spirit is saying go ahead set the table get started and you're looking forward to moving forward. And you're, you're essentially, you're looking for your ships to come in. And those ships is the plan you're putting in place. Okay, Libra? And then we have the Four of Cups. The Four of Cups clarifying the Six of Cups. This is saying to me that you have been, I feel like this person from your past, you haven't trusted them for quite some time. That's what I'm getting from this. The person from your past who has trying who has been trying to have authority over you, you have not trusted them for some quite some time now, Libra, and now you know why because you're you're not okay with them trying to run your life and and tell you how your life is supposed to go, so you are completely over it. You're just like ignoring the foolishness and while you're ignoring the foolishness, foolishness, you're going to also level up. You're going to level up and come into power. We're going to forget the foolishness and we're also going to raise the vibration and come into your own personal power. Okay, Libra? Now, this setting boundaries, threshold protection, honor, that's you're going to have to set boundaries with this person from your past. The Being from your past, I feel, and by saying that, let me clarify, this person from your past is currently in your life. So I feel like this is a parent or an older sibling, aunt or uncle, even a grandparent. They have been trying to run your life ever since you were born. And as an adult, 
you tolerated it, even though sometimes it didn't feel good. Here's your, here's your sign. Spirit is saying, set boundaries and hold the line. Again, set the boundaries and hold the line, Libra. The Spirit is helping you. Spirit is letting you know it's time to do something different. And you absolutely can do this. You absolutely have what it takes to do this. All right? Queen of Cups. The Tower. Uh-huh. And Six of Coins. Okay. Okay. So, with this Queen of Cups en energy, as far as setting these boundaries, I love this for you. This is being nurturing to yourself. Understanding that there are beliefs that haven't always been yours and you just went along to get along you didn't want to rock the boat but now the queen of cups is saying nurture yourself and come into a place of emotional security you are going to have emotional security and no longer be able to be manipulated okay because you'll have that personal power holding you up shoring you up right and the tower moment, this tower moment, things have to change. Spirit is saying this is, it has to change and it's going to change. We are dismantling this authoritative figure that has been intrusive for quite some time. That's coming down. That's stopping now. That's what Spirit is saying. It's not going to feel good, but you have the revelation. Spirit is letting you know. You've had the revelation for quite some time now. This cannot continue. Set your boundaries. Hold the line. Okay? And then you have six of coins. This is beautiful for you, Libra, because as you continue to level up your life, come into your own personal power, be the authority of your life, right? Standing your ground, coming into contentment and joy in this process this is showing me there is harmony around you. There is love around you. There is give and take. And you are sharing of yourself with others who deserve to be in your space. Not everybody can go. Not everybody deserves to be in your space. Libra. Wheel of Fortune. <laughs> Libra, Libra, Libra. Oh my goodness. I love this for you. The Wheel of Fortune. It's your turn. That's it. It's your turn. A trend, There is something ending. It's something ending when you're doing this work. And now it's your turn because there's a renewal of you, Libra. New Libra. Who it is? Right? The wheel doesn't stop for anybody. And right now it's your turn. This is a change in your destiny because you're choosing your destiny by doing the work, Libra. And then we have the six of wands for you. All of this work, all of this hard work, right? And here you have success. You have a victory. You have a win that just, that feels so good to you. Okay. Public recognition. I mean, all because you want to change. You want to do the work. You want to dismantle old beliefs and systems that no longer serve you. You want to take back your own personal power. You want to grow your own personal power. And then you have the chariot. Let me tell you something. There is no no stopping you. You are determined to get this done. You 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 are calling out the to the deepest parts of your willpower, Libra, to get this done. And you will move forward. You control this whole scenario, Libra. There's nothing that can stop you because I'm seeing your determination and what it is you're doing right now. The work starts right now. The work starts right now, Libra. And there's no stopping you. I love this for you. This is beautiful, Libra. Thank you so much for joining the video if you made it to the end of the video, this was absolutely for you. There's no other way this could happen. It's divine connection. Thank you again for watching. I hope it has resonated with you and it helps you along your journey. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Click the notification bell so you don't miss any videos I have for you. I will see you soon, but until then, bye-bye.